page 727727, and we are in the end of the right column, the second paragraph of Vov. The Mekudah that Rabbi mentions when he gets the Gimel the Pur Anusa, which ends on the Shabbos of Tisha B'av. So when we do the Tainus of Tisha B'av, as the Rabbi says, even if Moshiach would say, Fahatun Chas V'Sholem, it will be after the cross of the Pur Anusa. This brings out the inner meaning of the Tlos of the Puranusa. So the Gimel de Puranusa is harmonizing with the Gimel Meichin, which is connected to the Kenik Nizi Vekadmeini. Nesav to the Sheva Arotz is connected to Biru Razayin Midois. Oich the Gimel Arotz is from Kenik Nizi Vekadmeini, connected to the Gimel Meichin. The other Rabbe, the Baal, as the Gimel from the Gimel Meichin, comes to Arois Laacharei Hahelem, is that Beyeser Seis or Beyeser Ois, Ki Yisrael Ha'oyr Min Ha'chayishach. So it's going to be in a stronger Oifin, <coughs> because it comes after the Helam and the Chisha. So the Gimel de Puranus is far more with the Gimel Meichin, but in the Eifen of the Gimel de Puranus is in the Eifen of Helam, and it comes out with Golu. V'yash l'kasher z'oich mit di parashi is ha-shavua from the drei wochen, pinchos mat o is masay dvorin. What's the connection? In these three parashiyos, it is discussed the union of Chalukah Soaretz. The parashas Pinchas, it says, which the Rabbi spoke by Rikos and the Fabrengen that we learned in Parashat Pinchas. The parashas Matos, the parashas Bnei God, Reuven, Yutan, and Soaretz, as well as the Abadach, and the Achuzo, may ever have yard in Mizrocho. And the parashas Masay is Zoi Soaretz, as she tipoi lochem, and it gives the boundaries, as she as she is not cholu oisu begirol gimel. And then the parashas Dvarim, as chol as a parasha pnuus ulochem a boy har ha emirim al kol shchina begimel eret. Haknan iba halavodin adanor agodin harpros reino sati lifleichem es oretz boyu reshu es oretz asher nish ba'avay elav yisichem gimer when we see my parsha kibush eretz sichin ve'oyig when we see nasa the bnei god the bnei reuven so we see over here that all three parshiyos talk about chalukah es oretz because matis and masi is connected and becomes like one parsha but in both of them it speaks about it. And the Proteus Yosef writes in the three parashas about the Chalukah as the Oretz Kula. Not only about part of Eretz Yisrael, but the entirety of Eretz Yisrael. Not only about the Yard in Ma'arovo, but also about the Yard in Mizrocho, which is not just the God of the Reuven. As this is given the Aschola from Kibush and Chalukah as Eretz Gimul Umay, Skeni, Knizi and Kadmoni, which is Edoim, Umoyo and Amoy. And we see those parts of Eretz Yisrael as well, Included in the discussion of Eretz Yisrael in these parashiyos, the Shloima has indented in the rumors the Gimel Meichin was coming to Zaman with design with the Kibush Zayin Arotzis Me'eber Ayardin Ma'arova. When the Gimel Shabbos is from the three weeks, when we learned in three parashiyos, B'shon Azu, B'sfir and Arayin and the Shabbat and the Chem to Shol Acharei Zeh. So you have the three the Gimel Meichin, which the Gimel Meichin is connected to Knesi Kenik Knesi Vekadmoni. And in the three parishes that we read in the three weeks, in Pinchas, Matis, Masse, and Dvarim, it speaks about the entirety of Eretz Yisrael, even the part which is by Bnei God and Bnei Reuven, which is the beginning of the Kibush of Kenik, Knizu, Bekadmoni, Edim, Moyov, and Amon. And that leads us to the Shiva, the Nechemta, the union of the Zion Midas. And 
as a chonet a sida eretz yisorshet is pashet mechol arotz is kemendu ber leil that this is the inyan ba'avida of chalukah sa'aretz and it's verbunden with the hispashtus of eretz yisrael and verbunden with I'm sorry verbunden with the avida of making a dirah mit achtoni mitachlis ashlemus mach do eretz yisrael which mitachlis ashlemus means that it's the machshava dibur ma'ase. That that side that I'm explaining Pinchas side it's not that which you're being mevarer it should be betachlis hashlemus and side the person who's doing the birur should be betachlis hashlemus with all his inyanim with mechshav and dibur ma'is. Zayin v'yashloimar as der inyan from Gilei Hamoshiach betisha ba'av b'mincha when we see farbunin mederaboyde in Eretz Yisrael. Is noch mehr bei Adgosha in der Parsha, was man lehnt, mit viel as Mincha von dem Shabbos Tisha, of Shabbos Chazoy in Parshas, wo es Chanon. So really, until now, we spoke about the Indian of Tisha B'Av, and the, the mile of Tisha B'Av on Shabbos, and the special Nekuda of, the, the, the special Nekuda of Leida Samoshiach. So, then the Rabbi said, we see it in the Parsha, it's in the, in the Gimel de Puranusa, the whole Arichus Farmundin with, the Gimel Meichin, and now the Rebbe connects it actually to the Kriya Satir of Mincha of this Shabbos, the Parshas Vareis Chanon. Learn them Klal as a Torah he needs to from Torah Menashe Nehira. All the Inyanim and Torahs that he needs to him leOlam Vaed. When given Aris Hayrois needs to is to Eden Bchol Zman and Bchol Mokim. So, based on this Yisoid, that the Torah is <coughs> eternal and the lessons of the Torah are eternal. Eternal means that there's a lesson for every year and every time. Während die Schein der Wasser der Hero nichts ist von wo es kann und dabei. Viel als möchte zu dem Eberst in der Zelle reingehen und er hat sich so laut fühlen über Kosche, was ist damit nicht mehr ihm geworden. Und wenn mehr ist, dass ich eure Begeder von meiner Habe habe. Whatever happened, happened. In other words, was habe ich von dem? So Möcher habe ich nun weg der Eberst, der an der Eberst said no. Und Möcher habe ich nun nicht mehr in der Zelle. So what do I have to take from the fact that Moshe Rabbeinu begged the Eberster again and again to go into Eretz Yisrael, and then the Eberster said, no. What happened, happened. It was not a test. But it has to have a hero, because the Torah is Melosh and Hero, the Torah is a Nitzchis. Is there a mirror in them? Says, move on a portion around the bottom of page 728. Says, move on a portion, as philosophy shall Moshe bleibt alle mal betekif. Und mit sicher me kuyim ber. Me me kol shekein von der tfilo von yad er tzadik. So for sure, it's filo of again and again. It's going to be niskayim. Al achas kama vekama tfilos shel meishe rabbeinu v'safilu ma'isi yodim zayn nitzchim. Al achas kama vekama tfilos in la'avaya. If ma'isi yodim is nitzchim, so for sure, the tfilo of meishe is nitzchim. And we frat as meishe if them is pal given tov kuf tes vov kiminin v'eschan and filos. So five hundred and fifteen filos. So what's the nukunda? Ilu zochum al tefilas meishe demot mekoyim gevor. And there was a rain gefirt eden in Eretz Yisrael. And the boat in Beis Hamikdash. And demot al das given abayis nitzchim the geula nitzchis the geula shleima to megor besvarim. If we would have been zeicha, if the yidden would have been zeicha. So then Moshe Rabbeinu would take us into Eretz Yisrael, build the Beis Hamikdash, and that's it. It would be a geula nitzchis. If they see by his shoyneis is tefilas meishe demot nit mekoyim gevor. The Puyel by Elam Hazar Gashmi. Then it was not Niskayim, and in what even in Elam Hazar Gashmi? So the Dixera was his dam given as Moshe that applied him to Nei Dora in Midbar Kedola Kama. But Zayin the Katfilo from Moshe, not Tov Kuf Tes Vav Filois, but the Zichrim and Kuyim Veren, not Shpeta. It will be Niskayim, just not right away. On a later date. When is the later date? Because Ula Amitis Vashlema Al Yedei Moshe Echtzit Kenu, was Goyel Rishon Moshe Hu Goyel Achroin. When er fiert da rein alle Eden in Eretz Yisrael, wie geula she'ein achere ha'gol, so be minin beis ha'mikdash ha'shlishi, ba'is nitzchim. Moshe Rabbeinu will lead the Eden into the geula. Kum der von eus, as tfilosu shal Moshe is kayem es lo'ilom, und pe el es pe ulos, und nit noch bisman ha'hu, noch la'achere isman, Moshe Rabbeinu's tfilo is effective also for the future. When es kum de geula nitzchis, und Moshe geul rish, und geul ach, und fiert da rein, Ali Eden and Eretz Yisrael, that is the response and the Amish that are accepting the Bakosha and the Tfilo, the Tov Kuf, the Zohar Tfilo, of Moshe Rabbeinu. 
But now that Chas Vashon Amesh Rabbeinu asked, and the answer was no, and that's the end of the tefillah. We are, what's going to happen is really going to be behemshech to the tefillah of Amesh Rabbeinu. Because Amesh Rabbeinu is Goyal Rishon, and who Goyal Acharein is the fulfillment of that tefillah in Oilam Haza Agashmi. Based on this, we'll see the Hiroah, Ezra Hashem, tomorrow, and Biz Yemel, and Zich and Miskayim, Beren. The Rebbe says that the that the that the that the that the Nosi Hadoy from the from the day of the Geula is is Mamish Meisha Rabbeinu Alein. There's a lotion from the Rebbe, so we'll take it from Yad Mamish Zirchezayin be his Galus Hatzlocher Rabbe.